Hey Fred, this community center is putting on a production to make the performing arts more relatable to young people in the upstate. 7 News' is Christine Scarpelli joins us live. She's in Greenville at the Phyllis Wheatley Center. Christine, good morning. That's right. This is a fun one, Olivia. I can't wait for you guys to see The Wiz. It's coming here. You guys probably know the Dwight Woods Repertory Theater. This is an infamous program here at the Phyllis Wheatley Community Center. I mean, the center, Brittany, the program coordinator and the head honcho behind. I'm still <laughs> trying to get her to work for Channel 7, but she will not come work with us. <laughs> but any day now, I think it's going to work. You do it all. This is so impressive. I'm saying this program has been around forever. But The Wiz, why pick The Wiz? Just because of the culture and the the heritage of his background it just fits this community so maybe mm -hmm. how's the wiz a little different than the wizard of oz yeah there's more of a like a jazz um or african-american soul background to it so so the music the music the, the dancing dance. oh, yeah yes and and i think probably a blast for the youth oh yeah they, they get to it. try it with the program <laughs> of course they're doing other things singing and music production there's podcasting going mm -hmm. on with this yeah particularly with the acting on The Wiz Jr., what are the kids learning? What, how are they growing through this? Oh yeah, they're learning definitely confidence and consistency and um, leadership. Showing up, those. doing yes. their best. Yes. Guys, I think confidence is a main part of this. Do not miss this show March 17th and 18th, 7.30 and then 2.30 and 7.30 on Saturday. And we have to see. We've got Makaya and Kimari. They're going to dance and do a little singing for us. Kamari, I want to take home. He's absolutely <laughs> adorable. Give me a smile, buddy. There he goes. I'm so impressed with them, guys. Enjoy the show. It's coming up next weekend.